In this video, let us revisit the formula to calculate the correlation coefficient. R x y is equal to covariance x y upon standard deviation of x into standard deviation of y. Here, R x y is the correlation of the variables x and y. C o v x y is the covariance of the variables x and y. S x is the sample standard deviation of the random variable x. <coughs> And SY is the sample standard deviation of the random variable Y. The key point here is that it is a sample deviation and not of a population. So we had earlier determined the covariance in the economic growth rate and rate of return example. Now we will find out the correlation between the two using the same data table. We will first have to find the standard deviation. So let us see how to calculate the standard deviation of the two variables. S of x is equal to under root of summation xi minus x bar whole square upon n minus 1. Here we are using n minus 1 in the denominator because this is a sample statistic and not a population one. So putting these deviation values and here n is being 4 so in the denominator we get 3 and sx is 0 0.90 using the same concept sy is 2.58 so we have found out that the covariance x and y is 1.53 in our earlier video and now we have the standard deviation of x and y which are 0 0.90 and 2.58 respectively so we can finally get to know that what is the covariance between x and y. Putting the values we get 0.66 as the correlation coefficient between x and y. As you can see that it is a positive valued correlation coefficient and it signifies that the variables x and y are positively correlated. Also a 0.66 value shows that strength of the correlation is